government overreach, personal freedom, and the push for structural reform stir public emotions. We are not prepared to be governed by criminals. And we are going to purge DOJ. We're going to take apart the FBI. The FBI, the American Gestapo, that building on Pennsylvania Avenue, we don't need $40 million for a new headquarters. You're not going to need a headquarters. You're not going to be in the FBI. We're going to get everybody out of that building. We're going to take it down ugly slab by ugly slab. It's the ugliest building on Pennsylvania Avenue. And we're going to do what the Romans did to Carthage. We're going to salt the earth around it so there'll never be another building there again. In mainstream media, don't sit there and go, oh, they want to get rid of the FBI. They're doing such great work on terrorism. They're doing such great work on this and that. Yeah, they did great work on terrorism. 9-11, great work. You haven't gotten anything right, and the CIA had not got anything right in 50 years. Because you're spending all your time going after Catholics pray, praying rosaries at abortion centers. You're going after moms and dads going to school boards. You're an American Gestapo, and it's going to end on our watch. And we're going to rebuild something else. There'll be something that comes up and is rebuilt along the lines that's appropriate. Not a federal police force, not a federal police force that's in citizens' business. Not a federal police force that are with jackboots kicking down doors and arresting innocent people. You're going to be put on a short leash like the CIA is going to be on a short leash. The DOJ is going to be on a short leash. It's going to be a new day. And MAGA will run things. The globalist elite uniparty will not run things in this country. Steve Bannon sharply condemns the FBI and the Department of Justice, viewing them as emblems of excessive power and corruption. You likely resonate with Bannon's assertion that these institutions have deviated from their original purpose, becoming forces that oppress ordinary citizens. Bannon argues for the disbandment and reformation of these agencies to restore trust in the government and safeguard individual liberty. He champions the theme of personal responsibility and genuine governance, urging a serious, radical effort to challenge what he dubs the FBI's unfairness and deceit emphasizing the need to rebuild structures that respect true democratic values and personal freedoms. Bannon's stance can be seen as a call for true leadership and resistance against an oppressive system. Bannon's rhetoric significantly impacts the collective mindset of his audience. By labeling the FBI as an American Gestapo, he creates a sense of urgency and fear, motivating his supporters to demand drastic changes he skillfully uses historical references and vivid imagery to heighten fears of government repression and the erosion of personal freedoms, thus bolstering a narrative of resistance and empowerment.